here and not out killing someone. Um, is Spinelli home? Yeah, he's upstairs practicing. That's what I was afraid he of. He practiced all night long. Yeah, that's probably why you have dark circles under your eyes. You know, you really should consider some sort of maintenance regimen. It doesn't have to be difficult, cold water, generic moisturizer, but that's not why I'm here. Why are you here? I need you to do some sort of, like, mob thing on Coleman. Lean on him, threaten to break his kneecaps. He needs to cancel karaoke night at Jake's. Karaoke night? Yes. This is going to be a disaster. You can't let Spinelli get up there and sing just to prove he loves me. What if he's terrible? He's going to feel unmanly and horrible, and then he's going to push me away, and I'll be heartbroken, and he will be too, and you can't let that happen. La, 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 la. My Maxi is divine. Her beauty is sublime. Her eyes are sparkling blue. To her I will be true. You sound good. What happened? How did your volcano turn out? Good. I had more baking soda lava than anyone else at the science camp. Good for you. Nice. I can't wait to see the pictures. Here. How was your horseback riding lesson? Mm, fine. Well, I can't wait to see you go over our double oxer. Ugh, it won't be that dramatic unless Clipsy flashes back to his Grand Prix jumping days. Mm -hmm. I hope they don't have you on too much horse. He's a lot of fun. I'm sorry I missed your lesson. Well, you shouldn't have to deal with the other parents staring and whispering with all that's going on. I really appreciate how both of you are dealing with this, and I know that it's not easy for either one of you, but I hope that the media and even all the blogs are moving on to something a lot more interesting. Okay, let's hope so anyway. My friend, you have a very real disaster on your hands. Yes, I want all the shades removed, including the sitting room. Thank you. Ahem. Hey, if you come over here and help me, I'll give you a nice kiss. Didn't that already get us in trouble? <sighs> what is this? You can't just walk in without knocking. What if Nicholas had been here? Well, then you would have had to think fast. <sighs> now, what is all this? You planning on leaving town without me? No, moving in with Nicholas. I don't think so. so relieved. And Coleman will be too. Or he would if he knew what was about to happen to him. What? Surely you do not encourage Dunkel to inflict bodily harm on the saloon keeper. That's besides the point now that you sound so much better. How did that happen anyway? Oh, uh... Well, I've been, I've been, I've been vocalizing nonstop as Stone Cold can surely attest to. And, um... And, and, and while practice does, does increase the probability of a perfect performance... Uh, the secret of my vocal improvement is a little more complex. Complex? Well, when I sing into this uh, particular microphone, something happens. Okay, what is it? <laughs> is it about me? Well, when singing into this particular mic, I, I imagine the luminous beauty and passionate spirit of Maximista and all the love in my heart, courtly and otherwise, transcends into song. Spinelli, 
that is so beautiful. Jason, why didn't you tell me that I inspired Spinelli to become such a great singer? Come on, that'll be fun. It's a terrible idea. Coleman needs your support. I already told Coleman that I'm not singing karaoke. And Judy already said that she was staying that with Emma. Great, let's go somewhere else then. Well, everyone's gonna be at Jake's. I hey, know. Matt, hmm. would you like to go to Jake's with us tonight? Oh, I'm pretty sure I'm banned from that place after what happened last time. Oh, come on. You just found out that you were being sued for malpractice. Anybody would be upset. Yeah, but not a lot of people would have picked a fight with Johnny Zakara. Hey. As soon as Patrick and I prove who murdered Brianna, that whole malpractice suit will go away. I don't need you guys getting me out of this. Mm, gracious as ever. Okay, time out. You know what I think would do us all some good? A night out of Jake's. Yeah, I've... Got surgery tonight, actually, after a pair of cerebral aneurysm. Apparently, some people still think I'm a competent surgeon. Tiffany, I need to review those labs before I need the surgical team, okay? Oh, I'm sorry, Dr. Hunter, but you've been taken off the case. Oh, Christina, Molly, you poor kids. This must be an unmitigated nightmare for the two of you. By the way, I hear that's very good. It is. By the way, the kids are handling this very well. Thank you. That means that no one in this room has turned on the television or logged on to the internet lately. Brace yourselves. You're kidding. Really? Yeah. Girls, up, up, go, do something, anything. Hurry. Is Mom in trouble? Sorry. Are you kidding me, really? You gonna talk like that in front of my kids? You should have sent those kids to summer camp in the Bahamas when this whole thing first broke. Now you cannot protect them from it. What happened? In a word? Emails. What emails? Mm -hmm. The ones you supposedly sent to the mayor. Let's see, subject lines. Uh, okay. The night was beyond physical, it was electric. What? Uh, something that we can get as wild as you want. Uh, oh, the always effective. Don't use your stupid wife as an excuse. In short, my friend, there appears to be ample evidence circulating online that you are an obsessed stalker who set up the mayor for spite. It's always a good idea to know who you're talking to before you start promising kisses. Yeah. Excellent advice. After all, it could have been Alfred. Oh, God. Uh, he's busy upstairs supervising the staff. Rebecca moves in today. Nicholas, you're one of my closest friends. Even when I think you're making a big mistake. But I am going to keep my promise. No more lectures, no more sage advice. I am just here to see how you're doing. All right, thank you. Anyway, uh... Rebecca hates all this stuff, so I'm trying to get some of it out of here before she gets here. Paul Beckman. Great, where do you want to start? Paul Louis Rainbow Song. Right here. Okay. Created. And listen, I know, July I know I'm probably moving too fast. Okay, and I'm 2009. But using the guitar I chords. I Rebecca, and she wants to be here, so I'm just going to go with that. Sometimes you have to take happiness where you can find it, despite the imperfections and the risk involved. So if that's what you're doing with her, then I support you. I've always hated this joke. E minor seven. Of course. Okay, like six fret and four. The deal fret. was to get your this hand song as much money as possible. It's gonna be called Quartermain or Casadon. You'd give me my cut, we'd move on to the next mark. Okay, yeah, we left things pretty open ended, as I recall. Moving on to the next Well, we never agreed that you'd move in with Nicholas and leave me with nothing. You aren't the only one having problems with this, alright? I mean, I'm lonely too. I'm afraid I'm gonna get so wrapped up in this guy's fantasy that I just end up nowhere. Then slow things down a bit. Okay, don't get. Caught up in his fairy tale. Nicholas loves all that kind of stuff. Ethan, I have to play along. Well, it's quite an imposition, isn't it? I can see you're suffering. Poor Charles is turning out to be way more complicated than either one of us. Take imagine. two. It's obvious that you're having a really difficult time. Take three. If I could help you through it, I would. But I can't. Okay, I, I can't let this opportunity go by. The closer I am, moving the on to the next, the next, 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 next. Moving, moving on to the next. Okay, yeah, moving on, on, moving on, moving on to the next one. The next, the next, the next one. And the next, and the next, and next one. Moving on to the next. To the next, to the next, to the next.